I'm scared, guys. I got two Assassin's Creed boosters here in my cool ranch Dorito stained fingers, and I'm really worried about this product. You know, I know it's short printed, and the only thing that's saving it is the fact it's short printed. If we look at, you know, March of the Machine Aftermath and the similar setup uh, last year, the issue is is that there's it's a small amount of different cards with a large amount of skins. So what ends up happening is you get most of the cards if you open one or two boxes, and then you think of the of the non collectors versions that have all the non foils and such, so people can get their hands on you know the cards to use. The thing we did see in March of the Machine: The Aftermath are the Chase Mythics that were really playable, and it kind of made the value of the box if you hit you know one or two of those. Well, this time you don't really have the playability. I think you have like Ezio in this, which is you know one of the real playable ones. Um, and I'm a big Assassin's Creed fan. One of the only games ever that I've ever completed 100% of, did every possible thing, completionist, was Assassin's Creed Origins. I love that game. And I love the fact that there's cards, Assassin's Creed cards. I think it's great. Um, the hard part is the good cards are some of the reprints, some of the swords and things like that. And um, there's just there's just gonna be a lot of them a lot of variants it's gonna flood the market and i paid i'm telling you guys 240 for these i got in early and um i did well if i was in the threes on these i don't know that i'd be cracking them i have more coming i, I don't know that i'm cracking them i think this is my only opening of these of this product which is why i'm you know kind of taking my time here with you today because i just you know it makes me nervous. It makes me worried. And uh, I think that's what everybody else is wondering, too. That's why you're seeing, the, seeing this thing swing. People saw some openings done of it, and they're like, uh-oh. <laughs> the population's really not good. And, like, some of the good pulls, like Socrates, like, I want to pull Socrates. Philosopher cards, like, I want to have a serialized Soc Socrates. A borderless foil, I picked up, you know, pre-release for four dollars and fifty cents shipped like that's bad if that's if that's one of the big uh, pulls in the set i mean the packs feel good i think they're trying to make the box of the beyond boosters kind of look like the sports cards and and those quite possibly um and it, it all looks good it's just the card pop is just not the greatest so like will i try oh yeah the foiling looks good though Will I try to collect this set? Oh, most likely I will. Loyal Inventor. Pirates, yeah, the foiling looks really good. Okay. Arno. We got the viewpoint. Yeah, they're, they're going up to sink. You played. We got the swamp. I love the lands in this too. Jacob. Black Market Connection. So again... This is a really good reprint. You know, it was in Baldur's Gate 2. Problem is, there's just going to be so many of them that hit the market, even though the print runs so limited. Right? So that's the that's the struggle that we're going to have with this. Layla. Aveline. And that's it. That's it. That's pack one. That's a, that's a scary thing. Scary thing. That's why I said I don't know... How much I'm going to open. Brotherhood Regalia. Shao. Okay. Drestia. Nice, beautiful mountain. Beautiful. Temporal. Mjolnir. Mjolnir. Abstergo. Okay. The company that, you know, made the, uh, uh, made all the tech. Bayak of, Bayak of Siwa. Yeah, there he is. I mean, Ezio does a really nice, like, I think for assassins, like if you throw him as your commander, which I think is why he's kind of holding some value. But if you look, it, there's not much. There's not much, man. Adewale. Hidden Blade. I don't know what I'm doing with my files here. i do that, because I don't really know what I'm doing. Hidden Blade. Okay. We got the planes. Another Abstergo. 
Oh, 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 no way! No way! <laughs> Holy cow! Holy cow, guys, it does come in this... I've seen a lot of openings. We're going to sleeve this up very quickly here, Mjolnir in the last slot. I've seen a lot of openings, and I haven't seen anyone pull a serialized card. Um, obviously, I wanted it to be Socrates, um, so... Uh, but I mean, you know, I'm not gonna, I'm, I'm not gonna complain. They're so hard to pull. Oh, holy cow! It's not number 143. Yeah, draw a card, discard a card. Whenever you discard an island, pirate, or vehicle, create a tap treasure. Okay. I mean, that feels pretty good too. Smoke bomb. <laughs> I, don't just, I don't even know what happened. I'm like three packs into this product. Um, silent clearing. Okay. Beautiful. So I'm going to set that aside because conspiracy. I feel like you have some of those reprints. What must be done? And I, uh. Guys, I don't. When I don't look for one and I get them, when I look for them, I don't. I don't know. I don't know. Assassins and this shit. Haystack. That's what you always fall in when you fall off. Reading effects. And okay. planes. Abstergo. Mule. Double tap on the mule near. See, this is what I mean when you just have so many copies of the same card. Right? Like, eventually, it's going to push all the prices down, even the different skins, because, like, everyone has one. There's a lot on the market. Fatal Push, that's pretty awesome. I'm going to throw that in one of my decks. Shao. Shay. Chain. Okay. Swamp. Spear. The Animus. Okay, we finally pulled an Animus. A Leonardo, that's pretty awesome. And again, this Leonardo, I don't know, is probably sitting at around 30, and this is supposed to be Abstergo. One of the top pools in the set, right? Because, you know, you had Leonardo, Socrates... Uh, Mary, Reed, um, and, um, which makes me wonder, because Socrates was in Greek. There's something special about this one, too? Like, I know Socrates was in Greek. I don't know. Maybe, maybe this isn't one of the main ones. And Cleopatra. Brotherhood? Pick reunion? That beautiful island. You guys can't see the blues and the foiling there it just looks it looks really good the card quality is pretty solid here and I'm, i want to say somebody mentioned jacob that they are from um belgium i didn't look but i remember i remember that being said Ezio, loyal revelations of Ezio, arno arno fiery islet nice I, I just really like these lands. I'm just going to have a collection of those, I think. What must be done? Man, that is... That is glittery. Um, Socrates, there he is. We pulled a philosopher. Human advisor. I wish I would have said human philosopher. Um, man, that looks good, too. Makes me wonder, like, I pulled a... Maybe I should hold the other one sealed for a while. I don't know. Let's see. Towering, Ballad, Cosmos, okay. Path to Exile. Pretty awesome. And etched. Triad, this is one of the, the better, you know, greater pulls of the set. Mjolnir. Okay. We got Kenway. An Assassin's Trophy. Nice. Got a deck that that's going to go into. Yeah, I love playing Assassin's Creed. Brotherhood. You know, the Brotherhood, that's the Brotherhood of the Assassins, where you'd always go in there and you're always safe. Always safe in there. Coastal Piracy. Mountain. Rest in Peace. Okay. Assassin's Trophy again. Okay. Conspiracy. Beautiful. Look at that glittering on the uh, on the center panel there. And Royal Assassin. Fun. 
An assassin. Not a royal one. Okay. Fall. Distract. Tax collector. Okay, we got Ezio. We got Reconnaissance. Island. Conspiracy. We have the Animus. Avaline. And Aya. Okay. We got one more pack. While there are more, and while there's a lot of reprints, and, you know, and things in it, um... The exile murder there are more packs you get to see more of me ripping packs excalibur this is the first one that we pulled um crazy staff of eden vault's key okay yeah yeah we didn't really pull any of the swords anything like that in this uh in that first box so let's go to box two Obviously, I don't think anything is going to beat the first one, because serialized pull. Oh no, it's still football, fine. I lied. I lied. Nope. You don't get more from this price. What was I thinking? Hidden Magister, Adwale, Murder, Fry. Monastery. We got another islet. I don't need to. Crystal. Jack. All right. Wolf kissed. And Desmond. I mean, even the textures are hard to pull. So like pulling a serialized is no joke. Um, you know, I imagine a serialized like one in twenty boxes. Tax collector. Templar. Forest. Another Excalibur. An Animus, another Excal. This is what I mean. Three Excaliburs, same pack. Two, two Excaliburs, same pack. And like, I don't know. I just feel like the values on that can't hold. They can't hold. Check out my Discord too, folks. Check out my Patreon. Join the Discord if you want to get in some breaks and you know buy some of these boxes. Human Haystack, um, Planes. Okay, Altair. Rest in peace, Evelyn and Hobby. Templar, Ezio, Ezio, Eagle Vision. Yeah, you guys know what that is. Layla, okay, a little Abstergo. Did we just pull a textured Ezio? We did. This is the top pull in the set, folks. Oh my god, what a banger two boxes. Holy cow. This thing's going right now. Somewhere around 170. Um, but this is like the big one because look at the ability. Menace, two drop. Assassin spells have free running. When Ezio deals combat damage, you may pay one of every. If that player has 10 or less life, when you do, that player loses the game. Um, wild this is this is a pretty potent card because it's a commander with all you know every color and uh slow drop has menace and it has that ability so i mean um that's a that was a textured so we got a textured um this is probably the best two boxes on youtube um i've, I've watched a lot of other box openings <laughs> so um they don't all look like that they don't look like this Brotherhood, Hidden Blade, Mirror, Loyal, Aya, Assassin's Trophy. I think I prefer. See what I mean? There's just too many variants. Ezio, here he is again. So, again, this one in the etched is still a decent chunk. It's like a $30 etched, right? Because he's just so playable. Um, it's just so playable. And it's Ezio. Right. Restart. Path. Well, that's you again. Reconstruct history. Origins. Remember, I finished Origins completely. Black Market Connections again. Man, a Capitoline Triad. Again. Again. Borderless. Um, cast one less for each historic card. Yeah, this is the one where I'm like, I'm not a huge historic card player. I don't, I don't know. It's fine. Cover of Darkness. We're gonna like that like the Ezio one that's exciting to me the others i don't know 
Drestia. Okay. We got Kenway. Excalibur again. Spear. Leonidas. It's beautiful. And the cover of Darkness once more. The etch does look good. The etch looks great. Hunter's Bow. Rosham. Brotherhood. Spear. Upstair go. Uh, we got one of him already. See, that's what I mean about the dupes. Sean. Petty. Ezio again. Same version. Well, same same one version of Ezio. Different version of the card. Two drop. Okay. See what I mean? See what I mean? Wolf kissed. Royal Assassin is not really a valuable card to begin with. I think they just pulled it in, put it in because of the flavor. Propaganda. Okay. Propaganda. Forgot that was in here. Yarl of Ravensthorpe. Conspiracy. Temporal Trespass. Beautiful. And Jackdaw. You know what? Maybe I didn't really finish the pirate one. Assassin's Creed 4? Is that 4? Become Eagle Vision. There he is. Senu Kenide. Yeah, I was using that a lot in Origins. Temporal. Okay. Jarl. Pack. Quite amazing. Couple boxes. See how we only pulled one Leonardo and one Socrates, though? I find that really interesting. Smoke bomb. But that said sushi bomb. You can tell what's on my mind. Um, Roshan Island. Oh, Socrates. I, submit. I stand corrected. We pulled one more. Uh, Royal Assassin. There he is. And Jacob. So let's take one more look at these cards here. Wild. We did get a borderless Leonardo. I mean... Which is great, but obviously this one in the texture is wild. And then we have Mary Reed. I'll have to check that out later. And then Leonardo. So we had a kind of crazy, crazy boxes. Check out my Discord. Check out my Patreon. And uh, yeah, we'll talk to you all later, guys.